currently using my newer action cam, which is a uh, Sony HDR AS300. And I'm uh, trying to hit the higher resolution, which is 1080i at 60 frames per minute. And we'll see what, uh, what happens. I'm also using uh, my Get Up Get 2 Pro action cam that I've got it mounted on my uh, ram mount on my handlebar and I've got it facing towards the rear so I've never tried that before. So we'll see what happens in that respect and then God willing I can patch it together and not lose all the sound whatever I want in it. I don't know quite how to do all that stuff, but I'm going to try to figure it out. Nonetheless, it's a uh, nice day today. It's going to be about 63 degrees Fahrenheit. And um, this is, won't be this way for about another 10 days because starting tomorrow late, it's going to one tomorrow. It's going to get 10 degrees colder than it is today for a high, and then uh, then the rain comes in, and we're going to have wet for at least four to five days, and maybe as much as 10 days. I don't know. They don't know what's going on for sure, but unsettled weather here in the springtime. They say April showers bring May flowers, so we'll see what happens. But uh, wanted to get out on the scoot and do another little ride with the newer camera and uh, give it uh, some different aspects of uh, the ride. I'm really pleased with this camera. I, uh, I took a short ride. I have yet to publish it, which I'll probably do before I put this one up. But uh, it was about a month or so ago, about a month ago, not quite, but a lot of snow is still on the ground and wet and sand and general messy roads. And I don't like to ride in that stuff anyway. I have to be cautious even with what it is right now because uh, they haven't totally swept and cleaned uh, the highways and the roads and such. But, but anyhow, so I did some uh, major yard work yesterday, got some things cleaned up for the springtime and uh, I thought, uh, well, I'd just go out and take a quick ride for an hour or so and then It's like so. Trying to figure out how I can get, um, I guess you'd say, a little more activity on my YouTube channel. I, uh, have a lot of subscribers but uh, what I'm trying to do is just uh, get some interest out there that maybe some people would like to see I, I um, in doing this video just to kind of give a little overview I, I have a little uh, wrist remote for my uh, get up get to camera and it's pretty basic uh, you can once you turn your camera on you have to turn it on physically and then um, then you have uh, then your remote 
since you had, I've already had it set up as a and Wi-Fi for it, you can turn the camera on and off. You can pause the record and what have you. Um, and the nice thing I like about the Get Up camera, much like I like about the new Sony, is that it's got a bright enough uh, record light that you can tell when it's uh, when it's recording and when it's not. With my uh, my Sony camera, I've got the uh, live remote version one or first one they came out with, and you can see when it's recording. But it also has a red light when it's recording, and when you pause it, it turns blue. So um, it's made it much easier than trying to touch the camera and whatever, which I did early on. But very distracting doing that so but, um, haven't been on this for quite a while and it looks like they got the road swept so it's good um, they sand this hill quite a bit during the winter time because it gets snowy and then icy and so forth so still see it on the side, but uh, I guess they haven't really taken the sweeper to it yet, but uh, that's yet to be done, so. quite a bit of sand here on this little in turn where I'm making out on the valleys like that. It's a beautiful sign.
between uh, guys doing uh, video logs and so forth, and they were a group of riders, like four of them or so, riding together, and uh, ahead of them were two couples, or a couple of guys, and maybe a couple and a guy, but they're on Harley uh, Electroglides, Ultras, and uh, they were going around a, a nice curve, I mean it was nothing's, nothing hard about any of it, but they, uh, one went off the edge of the road down the hill, flipped his bike over about five or six feet off the road, and he got thrown off, he and his wife, or girlfriend. And then the other guy that was ahead of him, I guess he pulled, stopped or whatever, but he got situated off the edge, and next thing you know, he's going down and his bike is rolling. So these guys pull up and they uh, get stopped, and the guy walks back. Of course, he's still got his video camera, video going. No conversation in it, but uh, one guy got hurt pretty good. His arm, his shoulder got bumped in the chest or whatever. I don't know if he broke a rib or whatever, but uh, one bike was totally upside down. The other one was laying on its side, and it was practically upside down because of the slope of the embankment. But, uh, so many times, um, And these are not young riders, by the way. They're not newbies. They're, I want to say, they've been riding for a while. They know what they're doing, supposedly. But like when I uh, watch the training videos that MC Rider Kevin puts out on, and I watch him all the time, and I subscribe to his YouTube channel, it's called MC Rider, and I would highly recommend anybody to watch it, because he's a good instructor, but it's like being aware of everything that's going on when you're riding your motorcycle, it's true with driving a car, but even more so with a motorcycle. And it's important to uh, know where you are, where you're stopping. Um, I don't know if one of them got too close to the edge because it was not much of a shoulder at all on this curve. And I think he just wasn't in control, wasn't thinking far enough ahead. real important that you uh, keep those things in mind. It's one of the things I do with my videos and those who watch it I, and ride with a motorcycle or know people that do. I always end my videos with the ride safe and ride often. And I emphasize ride safe because uh, it's important that you don't get yourself in a situation where you can get hurt.
Lake Dam picnic area. out today. 